Hi Dresser Kitties, Wendy here. Today we're going to draw the Earth to celebrate Earth Day. So let's get started. To draw this cute Earth, let's first start by drawing a circle. So because it's pretty big, I'm going to use this as my circle template to just go ahead and draw this circle to make everything a lot easier. So it's just something I found that was about the right size at home. So it's just a little cork dish. <laughs> okay, so now that we have our circle in, let's go ahead and bring it to life. And so um, if you're using a pencil, that would be great. If you can use a pencil is what I mean, because we're gonna be drawing some flowers on the sides right here, and I'm going to have to erase these lines. But I'm using a Sharpie because I want you to be able to see what I'm doing a lot better. So let's start off and we're going to draw the flowers around it. And so I'm just gonna start about right here. And I'm gonna use this curve right here as my guide. So I'm just gonna come out right here and draw a circle my center of the flower and then I'm just going to go ahead and draw petals all around it there so then I'm going to come over here and draw a leaf so just remember everything is kind of following this curve and everything is coming from this center and then I'm going to come right here again draw a smaller flower so another small circle and once again, mm, let's see here, this is going to be a little bit messier there. And then let's see, it's come to the, to the sides right here. And then a center leaf that comes all the way out there. And then on the bottom right here, let's just spruce it up again some more leaves so I really hope this drawing inspires you and we're gonna fill up this space since it's kind of empty right here I'm just gonna add two little circles just to decorate it a little bit so let's do the same exact thing on the other side so I'm just gonna kind of give myself a guide I'm just gonna come right across so let's say about right here be the center of my other circle the flower I'm just going to come along right here and do the same thing. And once again, we're going to come out and pop out some leaves. And then another small flower to approximate. Let's say about right here. And then the more leaves. And at the bottom as well. There. And then the dots would go about right here. On this side. Okay, so then now that I have my wreath in for the flowers, let's um, draw some draw so cute eyes in this area. So about right here, I'm gonna draw a big circle for some huge draw so cute eyes. And come right across and do the same thing. So about right here. Now my circles in, let's make them draw so cute eyes. I'm gonna come in here with two small circles for highlights and a curved line at the bottom and shade in the top. And lines at the bottom. And same thing over here. There, now that my eyes in, let's come above each eye and I'm just gonna draw a soft curve over each eye. 
And then right in between the eyes, let's give our earth a big smile and cap it off. There. So then now to make it look like the earth, let's draw some land, right? So I'm just going to come right here about in this area and I'm just going to kind of wobble this organic shape. So I'll just come about right here, kind of making it look like hair almost, but still a big chunk of land, right? So um, let's come to the sides. I'm going to spruce up the sides a little bit. Something like that. And then maybe over here as well. So there's no wrong or right way. Just have fun with this kitties. So then at the bottom, I'm going to add another one right here to fill up this space. And of course, I'm going to, since I have space right here, I'm going to add one island that looks like a heart. There. Okay, so then now to spruce it up even more, that would be really cute if we came to the sides right here. And I'm just going to draw a straight line across for some clouds. So then about right here, I'm going to go up. One big poof. Now I'll come to the other side, uh, maybe a little bit uh, about right here as well. And once again, I'll just make this one two poofs. There. And so now that we have that, maybe we can make this one. That'd be really cute to make this one the nighttime. So I'm just going to add the moon right here with a star. And then on this side would be the sun. So I'm just going to curve right here and then add some rays. And of course, since we have the star over here, let's add some birds, right? <laughs> so now that we're done with our drawing, I almost forgot. I'm going to come in here and erase the center line right here. So that's why I um, mentioned in the beginning, it'd be best if you're using a pencil then you can go ahead and erase this line right here. But definitely makes it a lot easier to draw the whole circle first and then put in these um, leaves and flowers. So right here as well. And I can't wait to see your fan art, see what you come up with. What kind of flowers you're going to put and what kind of shapes you're going to make your land look like. There. And that is pretty much it. I really hope this uh, drawing here inspires you and that I made this fun and easy for you to follow along with me. Thanks so much for watching. And if you loved it, please make sure to give me a like and subscribe, of course, so you won't miss any new Draw So Cute videos. See you later.